Here's the tutorial for Chapter 5 of Dragon Box. Level 1. 0 plus x equals b. Now all we have to do is get rid of 0. Now we have x equals b. Level 2. x plus negative 6 plus 6 equals c. Now we know that 6 plus negative 6 just equals 0. Get rid of that, therefore x equals c. Negative 5 plus 5 plus c equals e plus negative e plus 2 plus x. Any number plus its negative just cancels out to 0. Same here, any variable plus its negative cancels to 0. We have c equals 2 plus x. If we add a negative 2 on each side, there, and there, we can now cancel these two out as well. Therefore, x equals c plus negative 2. Negative c plus x plus d equals b. So, what if we add an, a c to each side? We can cancel that out. Now, let's add a negative d to each side there and there. Get rid of the zero, x equals b plus c plus negative d. e over e plus x plus negative 1 equals d. Of course, e over e just equals 1. 1 plus negative 1 cancels to zero, therefore x equals d. b equals x plus f times 5 over f. Now here, we'll use a canceling to just get rid of the two f's. 1 times f equals, sorry, 1 times 5 equals 5. x plus 5 minus 5 equals b plus minus 5. x equals b plus minus 5. We're on level 7 now. c times x equals 8. If we make a common denominator of c everywhere, we can cancel these two c's. 1 times x equals x. x equals 8 over c. a plus 0 equals c plus 7 times x plus negative c. c plus negative c just cancels to 0. 0 becomes 0. Let's do a common denominator of 7 on both sides. So we have canceled 7s. 1 times x equals x. x equals a over 7. We are on level 9 now. Negative a plus d times x plus c equals c. Now, if we add an a on each side, there and there, we can get a 0 there. Now let's put a negative c on each side. So add negative c to each side, and we get that. Now let's divide, let's actually have a common denominator of d on both sides. So now we can just cancel these two d's out. 1 times x equals x equals a over d. Level 10, 5 over 6 equals x over 6. Now here all we have to do is multiply the numerators on both sides by 6. 6 over 6, 6 over 6, cancel the ones, x equals 5. x times d over d times b equals g over b. Let's go ahead and cancel these two d's. Now all we have to do is multiply both sides of the equation by b. Now these two b's cancel out, and so do these b's as well. x times 1 equals x equals g. Negative 1 plus g over g plus 6 equals negative 5 times x over 7. Let's get rid of the, these g over g's first. Negative 1 plus 1 equals 0. Now, if we multiply both sides of the equation by 7, we can cancel these 7's. And now we'll divide both sides of the equation by 
negative 5, make that a common denominator, so we can cancel that out. 1 times x equals x equals 7 times 6 over negative 5. Level, uh, level 13 now, c plus e times x equals d. Let's get rid of the c first by adding negative c on each side. There and there, of course, negative c plus c equals 0. Now we'll divide this both sides by e. Basically make that a common denominator, which means we can now cancel out these two e's. 1 times x equals x. We're on level 14 now. a equals 5 times x plus 7. The easiest way is to get rid of the 7 first by adding negative 7 to both sides. I'm just doing it this way to show you. 7 plus negative 7 equals 0. 5 times x we need to get rid of the 5, so let's make a common denominator of 5 by dividing every term in the equation by 5. Cancel those 5's, so 1 times x equals x. Level 15 now. Hmm, so here, let's get rid of this negative b first by adding b on each side. Get rid of the 0. Now, Let's multiply every term in the equation by negative f and see what we get. Now we can cancel these negative f's. 1 times x equals x. Level 16, 1 over x equals 1. All we have to do here is multiply both sides of the equation by x. Cancel these two x's. 1 times 1 equals 1. 1 times x equals x. Next. Uh, we're on level 17 now. a over b equals c over x. Now here, now here, the x is in the denominator, so let's start off by multiplying both sides of the equation, of the equation by x, which means we can cancel these two x's out. Now, to get rid of the a, let's divide both sides of the equation by a. These two a's cancel out, and now we have to get rid of the b, so let's add, uh, let's multiply both sides of the equation by b. b cancels with b, x times 1 equals x equals c, over, c times b over a. We're on 18 now. First, first, let's isolate the x by get, uh, getting rid of that 5. Multiply every term in the equation by 5 so that we can cancel this 5 out. Now let's get rid of the a by adding negative a everywhere, or to both sides of the equation, there and there. Get rid of the 0. Now to isolate x, let's divide every term by 5. 5. 5 and 5, which means we can cancel these two 5's out, as well as these two 5's, and get rid of that 1, x equals that. First, let's add negative d to each side. Flip that card, add negative d there, and add negative d here, which means we can get rid of the 0 and 0 here. Now let's multiply every term by x. There, there, and there. Which means these two cancel, and these two cancel. Now all we have to do is divide every term by a negative d. Cancel these two d's. x times 1 equals x. There's level 19. Next, we have level 20. To do this one, let's multiply every term by x in the numerator, which means we can now cancel out this one and this one, 
Now to get rid of this 2, let's add negative 2 on each side. 2 plus negative 2 is equal to 0, so cancel that out. That out. Divide every term by d, which means we can cancel these two d's out. Now we'll multiply every term by e, which means we can cancel these two e's out. x times 1 equals x. Well, congratulations, you've just finished level five, uh, chapter 5, and you've hopefully mastered the basics of algebra. That's the end of this game so far, but for $5.99, you can buy the uh, buy Dragon Box Plus, which, uh, which gives you several extra levels. It costs $5.99. You, uh, you can find the link to it on the Android App Store down in the description below. Thank you guys for watching, and you can always follow me on Google Plus. Uh, link is below. Thanks.